there was a little bit of a problem in the initial phases of this new comic. Yeah. Joe 90 launched in January 1969. Okay, mm-hmm. the comic. Mm-hmm. Star Trek, however, didn't appear on the BBC until July 1969. Ah. Oh. So, a bit of a problem there because nobody working on this new Star Trek strip actually knew what the show was like. <laughs> Great. So the artists were given some pictures of the cast and of the Enterprise, but that was pretty much it. Yeah. So all those early installments of the strip were um, a bit odd, right. to say the least. Yeah, like what? In this Joe 90 top secret version of Star Trek, the nuclear rocket-powered universe starship Enterprise okay. was manned by a crew of thousands. <laughs> right. And it travelled the universe under the command of Captain Kurt. <laughs> Oops. Together with his rather shouty Vulcanite first officer Spock. Uh-huh, okay. And Spock and the rest of the crew referred to Captain Kurt as Skipper. Ooh, that's not right, is it? How yeah, odd. weird, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. So this Enterprise could actually land on planets. <laughs> okay, I'd like to see that. And the crew generally blundered around causing uh, genocide, uh, playing football <laughs> with giant gorillas... <laughs> a bit of a mess, but uh, great fun, that. Uh, anyway, so uh, although the artist working on the trip in the early days, Harry Lindfield, had reference photos of the, fo- the Enterprise, yeah. he apparently had none for the shuttlecraft, or space wagons, or space bugs, as the strip called space them. Space bugs. Yeah. So he had to make them up. His solution was pretty simple. Just draw Thunderbird 2. In the Star Trek strip. In the Star Trek strip, yes. <laughs> yeah. So basically, in the Joe 90 top secret version of Star Trek, you'd often see the Enterprise deploying fleets of miniature Thunderbird 2s in green and red with one minor alteration. Harry reversed those forward facing wings. Oh, really? Easy way to disguise Thunderbird 2, yeah, isn't, isn't it? Yeah, I think he got away with it, yeah. 